this welcome to the light up skill so today we're going to see the uh, the variables in the python okay so we'll see what is variables the variables are nothing but an, the name given to the data or the reference to the data we can say okay for example name given to the data here is so x equal to 10 here it is a data and we are giving a name to that data you can say the in a high level language or we can say our layman language okay it's nothing but and we are giving a name to that data so so that we can store that okay so what it takes is nothing but and so 10 it is stored in this thing so it's nothing but and the variables are the containers for storing the data values here the first thing is that and the other thing is if you go in the coding language right it's nothing but and the data is nothing but and we are initializing here initialization so it is considered as an initialization and it is as declaration we are declaring the variable and here is equal to is nothing but an it's an assignment we are assigning that uh, variable okay uh, this 10 equal to x equal to 10 we are assigning that value okay uh, so what is declaration the declaration is nothing but an the giving a name to that variable we are giving the name to the uh, variable so so that's the reason why it's a nothing but a declaration initialization thing but a, we are storing the value to the variable is called as an initialization what we are storing the value so whatever the data which we are storing is nothing but and we are initializing so let's see uh, by using this uh, uh, in the jupyter notebook by coding okay let me erase all these things okay. i will erase all the data i will check and all the stuffs here okay it will see let's do and hands on on these things okay what i will do just python okay i'll not use as a coding here i'll just as a markdown here let me post uh, for this thing is uh there's a headline for example if you take as a headline here okay let me clear on these things if x equal to one i will do okay if i just print it as x is right so we'll get an output here so output s is one okay in the python right uh, and unlike the other programming language you don't have to declare the type of uh, uh, the variable means the data type of the variable okay in the other languages what we are, uh, we are what we are going to do is uh, if you take a c language right what we are going to do is so before whenever declare the variable x equal to first we have to uh, first declare the data type of that and then we have to assign that this thing the variable but when it comes to in a python so it's automatically it takes by itself okay uh, so uh, we'll check the we'll check that too okay we'll check the type of uh, data type for this x you can see here how to check the data type is type type of x okay if you see the type of x so it is an integer so automatically by default uh, it will take so based on the data with the with the type of data so uh, it is going to take that value okay for this thing right uh, for the same variable can we can assign uh, it can hold the different types of uh, data types for example x equal to what i will do i'll just type my channel name x equal to allied so if i will just what i will do i'll just print an x here okay and uh, uh, let me check the type of uh, that too you can see here now the same variable what we have did is we have overwritten as an allied here before what it was there before it was there as an uh, the data called as an x it is stored in it here so what we have did is we have overwritten before uh, the data it is and is nothing but an it, it contains the 10 there what we have written we have overwritten as an allied here so now what is the data type based on that by default it will take it is an it is an string so if you can see here is the string data type here okay so we can by this we can say that the same variable can be used to hold the different data types and the other thing is other thing we'll check so how can we uh, what we can say is how can we declare or how can we declare the uh, multiple variables at the same time okay uh, we'll check uh, so for example what is what we declaring the multiple variables at the same time is nothing but time so we consider uh, if we consider and uh, this uh, the variable right so a comma b comma c equal to 1 comma 2 comma 3 then in this case what it has uh, a it has the value b is inside this and b is taken value of this 2 and c is this 3 
okay we'll see in the coding uh, for that okay a comma b comma c equal to 1 comma 2 comma 3 okay i have initialized that to and what i will do i will just use a print for that a we can see here we will get an a uh, let me call b also to check that okay whether whether it's working correct or not see we can declare the variables uh, simultaneously means the multiple variables can be declared uh, simultaneously okay and the other thing is only uh, for example the only declaration of a variable will not work in the python so whenever we declare the variable we have to assign that thing otherwise we'll get an error okay what i will do i'll just declare a variable i'll just run it what it is showing is it's not defined so what it is showing that the name r is not defined it will give an error if you not if you not initialize that value to that thing to that variable so so in the next uh, so in the next video what we are going to see is we are going to see the conventioning means how means what uh, uh, so how we are using the uh, means how to assign this variable or nothing but and the how the convention of a naming of a variable takes place how the variable name can it contains alpha or not how we are we can be uh, in what are the different types we can declare the variable so we'll see uh, we'll see in the next video okay, thank you guys we'll uh, we'll We'll catch in the next video.